Everybody say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Where's my coffee? <laughs> Everyone has their jobs. Illy's is to undo the stabilizers. Jackson's on the other side of the trailer filling up the water tank. And now I'm going to help the man back up. Yes. How are you feeling? I know it's raining outside, but you know what it's not doing? Snowing. Snowing. That's right. It's not, it's not snowing. It's not raining. So that's okay. Well, there's no cats and dogs either. <laughs> Driving again. Yes, Jesse looks just as weak as he did yesterday. What'd you think of our stop? That was some delicious wine. Delicious wine. Yeah. Good. What'd you guys think? Good. <laughs> yeah? I mean, you didn't drink any wine, but what'd you think of the area we stopped at? It was good. Yay. There is tons of green in Washington. It is true. So we stayed at our first Harvest Host location last night. It was good. The best part is we didn't like, there's the hookups obviously. And so we got up and we're on the road again within a half an hour. So that was good. Now we're going to turn our way to a travel stop. A truck travel stop to fill up my gas. So we tried going to a truck, like a travel truck stop, but again, it wasn't really a travel center. It's more for like long haul trucks, which I guess we could have gone there, but it's a little much in price. So we're at a different location. We're at a 76 gas station and check-in time for the Newport Little Diamond Thousand Trails is noon. It's now 10.09 and we will be getting there at one o'clock in the afternoon, it says, according to the map. But that's okay because I already made sandwiches for lunch. So, um, when we get there, I we will they will have lunch ready already. It's in the fridge. We've got groceries for the next four days, and I've already mapped out the next two um like stopovers. Well, like a rest area stopover, a little place we're gonna um spend the night. Um, the place we're going to spend the night after we leave Little Diamond, uh, Newport, Thousand Trails is going to be a, um, is it, it's going to be in Montana. <sighs> this is what I love about this channel. Like, none of my viewers are like, oh, your kids are so distracting. They all know I have kids, so. <sighs> Hannah, stop. So I was watching this YouTube video. We were listening to it. It's um, Jan and Dan and Jen Nevada, um, their YouTube channel. And um, it, I was watching a video. It was about like the top ten, like ten secrets about their channel. You may or may not know. 
one of them was like, none of it scripted. His wife, Jen, never knows what the topic is going to be. So whenever she talks she, and she has reactions, they're genuine reactions. Like, he doesn't have anything planned. He might have talking points. That's about it. I'm like, oh, mine is uh, not uh, very planned at all either. So, um, I'm not sure if there's going to be much between now and, like, when we get to the Thousand Trails. Um, I'll probably end this. I'm not sure how I'm going to end this video. It could be, like, probably, um, just ending the video by taking a, a little tour of our campsite area. And then a little bit about the, uh, park that we're at, what's open, what's available. Or I might do that in another video. I don't know. I don't know. I don't have any plan. Just whenever it's long enough, it's long enough, I guess. But the important thing is, my husband got fuel for the road. No, it was 13. But so far, so good. No um, cracked windshields, no flat tires, no horribly wrong turns. Nothing like that. Oh, and Anna, I fixed it. I'll be back. All right, so now we are at our final rest stop area that we're choosing to stop at before we get to um, Newport Little Diamond Thousand Turtle RV Park. It's I'm gonna mispronounce this, I'm sure, so it's fine. I know I'll probably mispronounce it. Sprague? Sprague? Eastbound rest area. I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm sorry. Kids are having peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. But take a look at this view. Yes, there's seagulls. Alright guys, what do you think of this stop? Illy? It's pretty and there's a lot of seagulls. I like this, I like this stop because it has a sign that says parking for cars, parking for trucks and trailers, has bathrooms, it's green, it's pretty, there's a pet area. I recommend this is a good stop. Could have more shade, but other than that, I think it's okay. So we're down here at the Welcome Center. That building right there, right there is a store. It's open Thursday, Friday, and Saturday limited hours there is showers over there I'll show you in, inside in a moment over here is a laundry room two dollars to wash and dry has this filling in paperwork and over here is one of the playgrounds and then down the way of it is frizzy golf, the swimming pool, hot tub, pool, lake, um, and there is also the um, clubhouse with like pool and ping pong and stuff like that. So we're going to go check it out for about an hour and then we can come back to our site and I can make dinner. Alright, I'm going to show you guys a couple more things and then I'm probably going to wrap this one up. Charles saw one, Charles saw two. Not bad. <laughs>